I V M. Hello and welcome to the Habit Coach Podcast. I am Ashtin Doctor, your Habit Coach. And today in the hot seat, we have Likhit. Likhit says that I am facing leg pain due to sitting in front of my laptop for 10 hours a day. What exercises can I do to relieve the pain? Or what other solutions are there? So Likhit, there are two, three things that you can start doing. The first thing is that I know we are all sitting in front of our laptops. In fact, I sit in front of my laptop all day. My coach sometimes wonders how I manage to only get like a few hundred steps in because some days are really, really packed with work and I'm writing my book, I'm writing my podcasts, all of this is happening here. So the way that I structure my working time is into 20 minute slots. This is called the Pomodoro technique and I've done a whole podcast on the Pomodoro technique. You can search for it. Now, what happens when you break it down into 20 minute or 25 minute work schedules is that you have five minutes of a break that you can take to create a half an hour slot. In those five minutes, get up, walk around, jump around in one place, Maybe do a few jumping jacks. This way, what you're doing is you're getting movement back into your body. Now, I know very often we are on Zoom calls where we are for one hour at a stretch in front of our laptop. When we can't get up, we can't stretch. Half the times we're not wearing pants, we're in boxers. So obviously, we're not going to get up and show everybody what we're wearing. So as a result, what you do is you start creating different seating positions through the working day. So for example, I have one seating position where I sit down on my desk. That means I'm on a chair. I have another sitting position when I'm sitting cross-legged on the floor. And then I have another sitting position where I'm um, on my sofa or I stand and I work. So what I do is I have a minimum of three sitting positions or three working positions that I operate from. Now, what I end up doing is I end up doing all my creative work while I'm sitting. I end up doing all my regular mundane administrative work while I'm standing and when I'm sitting on the floor and I'm working is when I'm just doing my writing for example. So what I've done is I've clustered in different aspects of my work day and put them in along with what position of working suits it best. The other thing that you can do if you are a person who gets a lot of phone calls you can walk while you're doing your phone calls. So get your bluetooth headphones on and just walk around the room. This way, what you're doing is you're getting some movement back into your body. You know, the chair was a fantastic invention because what it did was it allowed us to sit down. But at the same time, our body was meant for movement. And when we sit in this position, which is what I call the 90-90 position, wherein our feet are at 90 degrees, knees are at 90 degrees, our hip is at 90 degrees, what happens is that this position restricts the blood flow to our legs. It pinches the nerves that exist in our feet and our legs. And as a result, this is what causes pain. And this can lead to multiple problems going ahead. So what I suggest all of us do is I suggest we create these multiple positions that we can sit from and work from or stand from. This way, you're adding movement back into your day. The other option, like I said, create the Pomodoro technique. Every five minutes, get up, move around, jump around. I have a trampoline that I use. I jump on the trampoline. So I'm getting movement throughout the day in my body instead of just sitting in one place. Because like you know, you spend so much time, 10 hours in front of it, and then you get up and then you feel like you've been run over by a truck. Everything hurts. Your back hurts. Your body hurts. Your legs hurt. So start getting movement in and you'll see a dramatic shift in the way that you work. If you enjoyed this episode, and you want me to answer one of your questions, check out the link in the description below. Click on it and give me a nice juicy description of the problem that you're facing. And I'm going to go and try solving this for you. I am Ashtin Doctor, your habit coach. And remember, awesome lives, they start with awesome habits. Usually in a podcast, it's me who speaks to you and you who listens. But I've been seeing your comments and it's time. It's me listening to you. Following the overwhelming success of this podcast, the good folks at IVM Podcast Network have decided to come up with a Kannada adaptation of the show for those who prefer listening to it in that language. Do make sure you let your Kannada speaking friends know about this as well. So start these habits and share with us your progress using the hashtag TheHabitCoach. If you like this podcast, don't forget to check out other interesting podcasts on the IVM Network. You can listen to us on the IVM Podcast app or ivmpodcast.com. You can also follow us on social media. We are at IVM Podcasts on Twitter and Instagram. If you want to reach out to me, I am Ashtin Doc on Twitter and Instagram.
You can find lots more information on my website awesome180.com or check out different content on my YouTube channel called A W E S O M E 180. That's awesome180. Hey, it's been another great week on the IBM Podcast Network. On the Filter Coffee podcast, Karthik speaks with Shreya Sundaresan, co-founder of data-led climate organization Transition Zero. They discuss using data science and financial modeling to fight climate change. It's tough to be a comedian or satirist in India today, but Akash Banerjee is thriving. Check out this year ender episode of The Wire Talks where he joins Siddharth to sum up 2021. This week on Probation Set Promotion Talk, Abhinav talks about some basic tips to negotiate a good salary. On the longest constitution, Priya takes us through the issue of entitlement and reservations at the workplace, especially when it comes to caste hierarchies and sexual harassment. On the Habit Coach podcast, Ashwin is joined by Sonali Sabarwal. She's a macrobiotic nutritionist and they discuss how Vipassana meditation can help us get over stress and deal with other mental health issues. Do follow us on social media where IVM podcast on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram and LinkedIn. If you're enjoying this show or any of our other shows for that matter, do tell a friend. The word of mouth absolutely is essential to us. Don't forget to rate us on any of the platforms that you've been listening to and also I'd like to ask everybody to check us out on YouTube. We have a number of channels going. You can find all of them on ivmpodcast.com/youtube. And finally, we'd like to thank our sponsors this week, Cred, Bank of Baroda, Coinswitch Kuber and Intel. Thank you so much for making this possible. Are you looking for finance products and services that can enhance your personal finance experience? Are you looking for a space to talk about your financial product or service? And are you looking for a crisp talk show where the conversation is all about money? Well, your search ends here. Hi, my name is Anupam Gupta and I'm host of the Paisa Paisa podcast and I invite you for the conversation about your personal finance on each Monday on the IVM podcast app or the website or on any podcast streaming platforms. See you folks.